36 hours and counting. Police are still looking for Lisa Irwin. This afternoon, the family released new pictures of the little girl just 10 months old. Here is another new picture. She disappeared from her crib sometime between Monday night and Tuesday morning. Beth Vaughn was there this afternoon when her parents made a plea for Lisa's safe return. Hearing from them for the first time today, Beth, it was uh, quite emotional. It was, Krista. You know, since 4 a.m. yesterday morning, Lisa Irwin's parents have been on simply an emotional roller coaster. The 10 month old infant was discovered missing at 4 a.m. yesterday from her crib. And today, for the first time, we heard their public plea for her safe return. The couple tearfully read a prepared statement, but in that, didn't give any indication about where their daughter is or who they think might have taken her. Um, we just urge anyone that has any kind of information to as to where she is or who she's with or anything to please call the uh, tips hotline or the police um, any anything even the smallest bit of information could help lead to her return um, anybody that might have her um, they can drop her off at a, any place safe, fire station or hospital or a church. No questions asked. We just we just want to have her back home. We just want our home. baby back. Please bring her home. Our two other boys are waiting for her. Please just drop her off anywhere. We don't care. Just somewhere safe where she can come home. Please. Yeah. Hearing there from the parents to bring her to any place that's safe, a fire station, uh, a quick trip, perhaps anywhere that's going to land this baby home with them. You know, police say that they haven't gotten any credible leads, and because of that, they haven't ruled anything out. And in any missing child investigation, they always start with the friends and family. That's why Lisa Irwin's parents were, were questioned until about 10.30 last night. We'll have more on this tonight at 6. Back to you. All right, thanks, Beth. Here